Hey, what's going on everybody? Welcome back to another video. Now I'm gonna cut right to the chase. I wanna talk about AR Ab because I've been watching a lot of commentary on his recent indictment. Now, for those that don't know who AR Ab is, he's a rapper out of Philly, okay? And he was once associated with um, the rapper Cassidy. And um, so so he's out of Philadelphia and he's a, he's a rapper. Now, I've been watching a lot of commentary for the commentary for the past few days on AR Ab. And, you know, so I just want to, you know, give my thoughts on this on because a lot of people are saying that he shouldn't have been on Vlad TV. And, um, you know, Vlad, they, they're kind of blaming Vlad for all of this. So I want to talk about this. Well, number one, the only thing that we have to go on right now is what the news is reporting. But you can also go on the uh, federal website and they have an article. I think the feds out of Pennsylvania, whatever, they have a website and you can read the indictment. OK, so that's what you have to go on. Now, again, he nobody is really saying that he's innocent until proven guilty, but he's always presumed innocent until proven guilty. Now. What I did read in the indictment. That's all I have. I can't really comment on that because that's all I have. I don't know the exact details on what he was allegedly doing. The only thing we have is the indictment. Okay, that's number one. And number two, I want to stress again that he's innocent until proven guilty. Yeah, it doesn't look good when the FBI come in and land down a case on you because that means they really did a lot of spying on you to build a case against you. And they do have over a 90%, over a 90% uh, success rate in convicting people. So it doesn't look good, but it doesn't mean that, you know, he's guilty. So just want to point that out. And also, let me get into Vlad really quickly. Vlad runs a platform. Now, people come on his platform to do interviews. Okay? They go on his platform, they do interviews. It's not his fault if he asked him a question. If he, you know, say anything about their life and they decide to answer them, that's not Vlad's fault. The only thing that the, what they should say is before the interview, I'm not going to talk about this and I'm not going to talk about that. But if they choose to talk freely on, on Vlad TV's platform, that's not Vlad's fault. Because, I mean, a lot of you, you're not new to what Vlad does. You're not new to the question that the questions that he um, he posed to people. You know, we know how he runs his platform. So if you know that going in, it's not Vlad's fault. So nobody has said that. I've watched a few videos now. Nobody has said that. It's not Vlad's fault this man got arrested. You know, if Vlad is the feds, I want you guys to prove it now. How is Vlad working for the feds? And if he is working for the feds, can I see some documentation? You can't assume anything. But I just know that if I interview someone and they give me a lot of information to put in a video, you know, that's not my fault if I if I if I said something to them, if I if I posed a question to them and they answered me, then who fault is that? So I just wanted to stress that, man, it's not Vlad's fault. And um, a lot of people, they make videos and they don't know what they're talking about, especially when it comes to the law. You don't know what you're talking about, a lot of you. You know, I just, and you know, I just happen to like the law and I know a little bit about the law to know that, yeah, they did, they did um, bring down an indictment. It doesn't mean that he's guilty. It doesn't look good, again, when the FBI step in it doesn't look good but and they do have over a 90 percent um success rate in convicting people but i've known people to be federal cases as well it's, it's all these cases is documented and um like i said the media is very powerful the media put anything out there i don't believe anything the media says i want to see paperwork so i did see the indictment so let's see how this case um, escalates further in the future before people want to say that Vlad was the reason. Somebody said that Vlad is the reason why this man got arrested. That's not true. If it is, let me see the documentation. 
Because a lot of you, you just put stuff out there for clicks. That's what you're doing. You're putting stuff out there for clicks. Okay, so I'm the type of person, I'm going to challenge you now. Let me see the paperwork. If the man is a rat, if the man is a snitch, let me see the paperwork. You know, you can't just keep putting things out there about people. You know, this is that could be a deadly situation. I don't know how you guys grew up. When I grew up, I couldn't just tattletale and say anything about anybody without getting checked. That's just how I grew up. Maybe everybody grew up differently or maybe we're in a different day and age. But if Vlad does work for the feds, let me see it. Let me see the paperwork now. So that's all I got to say about it. Um, I am going to follow the AR ab case as it develops. But right now, only thing we have to go on is the indictment. That's it. So um, that's all I got to say about it. Let me know your thoughts in the description. All right, guys, if you like my videos, please share. And don't forget to hit the subscription button. Until next video, peace.